Yeah, Lankford says that federal charter makes the National Education Association a government-sanctioned organization. He says, or what he calls, a political interest group should have no ties to the government. In a press release, Senator James Lankford saying, quote, Oklahoma parents are tired of the woke ideology being pushed on their kids and the progressive values being forced into our schools by a giant teachers union, the National Education Association. Lankford arguing the association is no longer serving their original purpose, accusing their leadership of working lockstep with the Biden administration for their policy agenda, but not providing any examples of the NEA pushing such a woke ideology in Oklahoma. Quote, unions should protect and preserve workers' rights and speak out for the benefit of their members, not push a political agenda on our kids. The NEA is the only federally chartered union. It's time to hold them to account. We can't be attacking our teachers, politicizing them. Again, they are doing a public service. We have to ensure that we're trusting what they're teaching and empower them to do so in the classroom. Madison Horn, the Democratic nominee seeking to unseat Lankford in November, says her opponent has the wrong priorities. She says more needs to be done to help educators. We know some of the problems that they're experiencing, where that be underfunding or if that is issues of not having the resources that they need in the classrooms. Senator Langford said he did not have time to comment on our story today. We also reached out to the NEA for a statement but did not hear back.